star is born. There may not be anybody alive today who hasn't heard of Susan Boyle. What happened to the OG of the Got Talent shows? Susan Boyle is the mother of the Got Talent franchise. Her audition was one of the first viral videos ever. What's her net worth in 2021? Is she still singing? What does she look like now? All of this and more on this segment of What's High. Hey guys, it's Corey, and for today's What's Hot Topic, I want to look into Susan Boyle's life post Britain's Got Talent. Susan Boyle was 47 years old at the time of her audition and really impressed Simon Cowell with her skills. I am 47. <laughs> and that's just one side of me. Susan, you are a little tiger, aren't you? Even though she won second place on the show, she almost immediately rose to fame after her time on BGT. And some would say this is because of YouTube and Twitter's popularity at the time. Soon after her time on BGT, she released her first studio album, which quickly became the UK's best-selling debut album of all time. In her first year in the spotlight, she made 5 million pounds, which is about 6.9 million US dollars. After all the success of this album, she would go on to release her second studio album, which helped her become the third artist ever to top in the UK and US charts twice in the same year. Her albums gained so much success and popularity, and I'm sure you guys already know that she didn't stop there. She went on to release six more albums since winning Britain's Got Talent. So she won runner up in 2009, but returned back to the BGT stage in 2012 as a guest performance. This was seriously an amazing performance. I still think she should have won. A little later in her career, she got the opportunity to meet and perform with some of her favorite names in the music industry. Who would you like to be as successful as? Elaine Page. Elaine Page. Like Even though this isn't necessarily being more successful than her, she did get to meet and perform with her. In 2012, Susan got to perform and meet with one of her childhood teenage idols, Donny Osmond. They sing This Is The Moment on Susan's fourth studio album and even performed it together on Dancing With The Stars. Oh, I guess they'll never know. In 2013, she told the world that she had been diagnosed with Asperger's syndrome, which is a form of autism. When announcing this news, she expressed that she had always known she had suffered from brain damage from a young age, but she never got an exact diagnosis until later in her life. Now I have a clear understanding of what's wrong, and I feel relieved and a bit more relaxed about myself. But this medical diagnosis didn't really seem to stop her. She's known as the shy, quirky woman who has a great voice, and she really remained as that, even with this news. Back then, she said, I think people will treat me better because they will have a much greater understanding of who I am and why I do the things I do. Susan Boyle is still kicking it in the music industry and has even made a return to the Got Talent franchise. In 2019, she was on America's Got Talent, The Champions. This was the first time Susan sang for Simon in nine years and she even received a golden buzzer. Around this time is when people began seeing Susan's weight loss and when she tried out for BGT, people were surprised that she sounded the way she did because she didn't have the look. So in 2013, she was also diagnosed with type two diabetes and since decided she needs a little bit of a healthier lifestyle. So really she follows her doctor's suggestions to eliminate sugar from her diet. So this could be why there was such a change in her body and why it took so long for us to see it. Since her time on AGT The Champion, she went on to post beautiful song covers, recorded more music, and even recently celebrated her 60th birthday. Despite her popularity and newfound earnings, she's currently single and hasn't really dated much. In 2014, she had been seeing a doctor, but unfortunately it all came to an end pretty quickly. All I'll say is we are around the same age and he was a very nice guy. And as of 2019, it seems like she's happily on her own still. She said to the son, but if I had a man friend, it would be purely platonic. I've been on my own too long now to get married. Was that the doctor? That the doctor? Yeah. And I doctored her. <laughs> <laughs> but 
that doesn't mean she doesn't want kids. In the same interview, she talked about how she would love to become a foster mother since she regrets not having children of her own. What's she up to now? She still lives in her family's home, but it's a little different. When she made enough money, she bought the home and actually renovated it. So although it was her family's house, it doesn't really seem like it because it's not exactly the same. She's also spent quite a bit of time in her home in the past year or so too. In an interview from a few months ago, she revealed that, you know, she takes the coronavirus very seriously, stays in her house, and it's all because of her type two diabetes. What are Susan's accomplishments? What's her net worth look like in 2021? Her most recent accomplishment is that she had an appearance at the Tokyo Olympics. Her song, Wings to Fly, was played during the opening ceremony while doves flew around. As of 2021, Susan has sold 19 million records, has had two Grammy nominations, and has an estimated net worth of 22 million pounds, which is over 30 million US dollars. And I mean, come on, she's met the Queen of England and literally became an overnight sensation because of the internet. What do you think of Susan Boyle? Is she your favorite OG Got Talent contestant? Did I forget something? Let me know in the comments down below. And while you're there, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to stay updated on everything Talent Recap on YouTube. And make sure you follow Talent Recap on all social medias, head over to our website, and stay updated on your favorite competition shows and their stars. I'm at Corey Caesar on Instagram, and now you know what's hot. See you later. Hey, what are you doing tonight? Well, I think you should hit the subscribe button down below and then we can talk.